HIV negative, but symptoms persist. Are you experiencing persistent symptoms that you can't explain? Have you been tested for HIV and received a negative result, but your symptoms persist? If so, then this video is for you. We'll explore what it means to be HIV negative, but still experiencing symptoms, and what steps you can take to get the appropriate diagnosis and treatment. So, stick around to learn more about this important topic that affects many people. Understanding HIV and its symptoms. HIV, or human immunodeficiency virus, is a virus that attacks the body's immune system, specifically the CD4 cells, which are important for fighting off infections. HIV is primarily spread through unprotected sex, sharing needles or other injection drug equipment, and from mother to child during pregnancy, childbirth, or breastfeeding. The early symptoms of HIV may include fever, fatigue, sore throat, rash, and swollen glands. These symptoms can appear within two to four weeks of contracting the virus and may last for a few weeks. After this initial stage, the virus can remain in the body without causing any symptoms for several years. As HIV progresses and damages the immune system, more severe symptoms may occur, such as chronic diarrhea, weight loss, night sweats, and recurrent infections. It's important to note that not everyone who is infected with HIV will develop symptoms, and some may not experience symptoms for many years. Early detection and treatment of HIV are crucial for managing the virus and preventing the progression to AIDS, or acquired immunodeficiency syndrome. If you think you may have been exposed to HIV, it's important to get tested as soon as possible. Other conditions that can cause HIV-like symptoms While HIV can cause a wide range of symptoms, there are other conditions that can also cause similar symptoms. For example, the flu, mononucleosis, and hepatitis can all cause fever, fatigue, and sore throat, which are common early symptoms of HIV. These conditions can be diagnosed through blood tests and physical exams, and treatment will depend on the specific diagnosis. It's important to see a healthcare provider if you're experiencing persistent symptoms, regardless of whether or not you've been diagnosed with HIV. Factors that can affect HIV test results. HIV testing is an important part of early detection and treatment. However, certain factors can affect the accuracy of HIV test results. For example, the timing of the test is important, as it can take several weeks for HIV antibodies to appear in the blood after exposure to the virus. The type of test used can also affect the accuracy of the results.